Hey guys, welcome back to another video. If you're new, hello, welcome. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. You know all the good things. So I remember a few videos ago, I told you guys that um, in Sydney, we had all our restrictions lifted. People could hold large gatherings. People could host parties. You know, you could go to the club and dance, all that but we enjoyed that whilst it lasted so we have recently been placed in a two-week lockdown yes i know two weeks because the number of cases in new south wales were just going off the roof so i thought to myself maybe i should do a day in the life for you guys and show you guys what our working from home routine has been like Today is the second day working from home and I got the full on experience yesterday because I'd never worked from home before but I thought maybe I should show you guys what I did yesterday that I actually really enjoyed and I thought I should share with you guys. So that's what we're doing today. Um, earlier on I did my workout and now I'm actually about to get ready for work and you know start working. And this is the outfit of the day. I'm just wearing this black crop top and these navy blue joggers i just really wanted to be comfortable so i wouldn't have worn a crop top to work or joggers to work but since i'm working from home that's all right before i start the video i thought i should tell you guys what i actually do in my nine to five job i work in an accounting firm and what we do is we do tax advisory we do compliance so compliance is all like your tax returns preparing your financial statements preparing business activity statements installment activity statements your fringe benefit tax returns all that so that's what we mostly do we actually mostly do compliance where i work and my day usually is like maybe starting with a meeting uh, with my manager maybe a few calls to the australian taxation office and then depends on the day and the time of the month sometimes i have to prepare financial statements sometimes i have to do individual tax returns sometimes i have to do maybe a bit of research uh within the tax legislation it just depends and i actually don't know what i'm going to be doing today i actually have to have a meeting with my manager so he tells me what i'm going to be up to today so i'm about to start work now and i'll talk to you guys during my lunch time from now till lunch i will do a voiceover so now it's 8 30 i start work at 8 45 but i'm already sitting on my desk because i like to sign in and go through my emails before i actually have to start work so that you know my head is already in the right direction so this is our little home office setup and my boyfriend is also working from home he also works in tax accounting and i'm so lucky to have someone to be sharing an office space with even though he already wants to get rid of me so as you can see my day starts with signing in so i always have to sign into the office software that we use and we use two-factor authentication so that's why you see me on my phone and um, just going through all the applications putting in my passwords and all that so that's the first thing that i always do when i get into the office after i sign in i go through my emails 
so i always check my emails first because sometimes i get emails from clients um asking me about their work that we're doing for them or the clients would have sent through new information that we would have asked for so that's why i always check my emails it takes me like 30 minutes to go through emails or like an hour depending on the information that i've received on that day and sometimes my manager sends me work overnight like i would have left work at five and maybe he sends me work at 5 30 so that's what i'll be doing and now i'm on the phone with my manager having our meeting so we always have a meeting in the morning um even when i'm in the office he tells me what i'm meant to do i give him update on the work that i'm doing the financial statements i'm working on or the returns that i'm working on or the fringe benefit tax returns that i'm doing so this meeting actually took like 30 minutes so that took like half of my morning So whenever we have meetings, I always have my notepad with me so that I can take some new notes of the work that he's giving me. That is one thing that has really made me um, very efficient at work, always writing down my tasks and taking them off as the day goes by. This helps me to make sure that I'm on top of the work that I've been given and that I get each and everything that I've been asked to do done. So that's what I'm doing. And after our meeting, I went straight into doing my work. So this morning, I'm currently working on a business activity statement. So a business activity statement is like um, something that companies in Australia have to do on a monthly or a quarterly basis. So it's a statement that businesses prepare to notify the ATO, which is the Australian Taxation Office, of how much sales they have made, how much purchases they have made, and how much GST they've collected, or um, how much wages they have paid, and um, how much tax they have collected from the wages that they have paid, and how much um, tax they owe to the ATO. So the business activity statement is just really a statement that calculates how much tax a business owes or how much refunds a business is going to get from the Australian Taxation Office. And now it's turn 30. This is the time that I always have my breakfast, you guys. And I was starving because since morning, I had not eaten anything. And um, even when I'm in the office, I usually don't have any breakfast. I always wait for 10.30 and that's when I have breakfast. So from the time I leave home, to when I get to the office, I would just be drinking my water. And for this morning, I am having rolled oats with peanut butter. My favorite, you guys. I love oats and peanut butter. It's the best breakfast you can ever have. So with my oats, I always just put... Um, one third cup of rolled oats two third cups of milk and one spoon of peanut butter and i just chuck that all in the microwave and voila that's my breakfast and back to work So as I'm having my breakfast, I am still working on that business activity statement. So with business activity statements, it depends on the information that the client has. It can take me from one hour to two hours to complete a business activity statement. And the one that I'm working on this morning is just so much information. So it took me all morning to do it. Hey guys, so it's lunch time now. Um, I actually had so much to do this morning. I'm currently working on an individual tax return. I did a business activity statement this morning. I had a meeting with my manager. I made some calls to the tax office. So I had a busy morning and now I'm starving. So I usually take my lunch between 12.30 and 1.30 and now it's... 28. So I'm going to make my lunch with you guys and 
this is what I actually usually have even when I'm actually going to the office. So let's get into making lunch. So this is lunch guys, I have put in some mixed vegetables, so I have kale and spinach and some tomato, some cucumber, some feta and some sultanas and I'm just going to sit down and watch some YouTube. I would have gone for a walk but it's actually raining so I'm just going to have my lunch, sit down, watch some YouTube, watch some Instagram videos you know and get back to work in an hour's time i actually always look forward to lunch i don't know why i love working i love my job but lunch keeps me motivated throughout the mornings <laughs> i forgot to show you guys how i make this salad dressing which i'm going to use for my salad so this is how i make my balsamic vinaigrette i just put honey balsamic vinegar olive oil and olive oil and mustard and shake it that's it that's all i put in my salads most of the time sometimes i use garlic aioli but most of the times i just always make this balsamic vinaigrette and it tastes so good so let's have lunch now around 3 30 i always get up to stretch my legs and i'm doing a little dance for you guys because the day is going so well and i'm just checking up on my boyfriend to see what he's working on I just find it interesting to see the kind of jobs that they have at his workplace and how they do things because even though we are both working in techs, the way we do things, the way we do our processes is different. So I just find it interesting to see what he will be doing and how they do things at his workplace. it was around 4 p.m i'm um, just finishing up on my text return that i had started earlier on in the morning and just making sure that i'm taking off all the tasks that i'd been given by my manager in the morning before the day ends at 5 p.m And don't mind the blanket. I know you guys are looking at me funny right now because I have this huge blanket wrapped around me. It's freezing in Sydney, especially this week. It's been so cold and it's raining. And 5.30, we are done with work, guys. Woohoo! Hey, guys. Um, I'm done with work now. It's 5.35. Work was fine. Um, I had so much to do today. As I told you guys earlier, I did I did a text return. I did a business activity statement. I had a few calls to make. I had a meeting with my manager. And I've just finished work now. Um, babe, do you want to say hi to my vlog? Wave and say hi. Say hi. Say hi. So yeah, work was fine. I'm going to start making dinner now. If I had gone to work right now, I'd be on my way back from work. But because the beauty of working from home, I just get up from my chair and 
I come into the kitchen. So now I need to start making dinner. So for dinner, we are having some curry pork balls. Is it called curry beef balls? What, what, what are they called? Let me see, let me see, let me see. So for dinner, we're having some meatballs and spicy curry and some brown rice and some vegetables. And that will take me like an hour to make. So we should be eating around 6.30. So let me get cooking. Ready guys um, as I told you I'm having meatballs in curry sauce and some brown rice and vegetables how good does that look so that's it guys I think I should end this video here I hope you guys enjoy spending the day with me and you guys got to see how I've been spending my working day during this lockdown I hope you guys enjoyed it tell me how you guys felt tell me what you think about the video and if you haven't subscribed already what are you waiting for? And don't forget to turn on your notification bells so that you do not miss any new video from me. But till my next video, you guys, goodbye.